Penang has decided to go against an instruction from Tourism and Culture Minister Dato Sri Nasri Abdul Aziz for states to stop collecting hotel room-based local government fees once the tourism tax takes into effect on July 1st. Penang Chief Minister Lim Guang Eng said the issue was not raised when the tourism tax bill was debated and he was surprised at the statement. No, no. That's why we were quite surprised at some of his comments. And then I say that in Penang. I think the, the problem is that he must not only satisfy Penang, he has satisfied all the other states. Uh, Sarawak and uh, Sabah, uh, both states are very unhappy because they do not know how the uh, revenue will be distributed. So I had suggested earlier that we want to get Sabah and Sarawak to accept this formula. What you, must, what you need to assure them is that all monies collected from Sarawak, you must return them back to Sarawak to promote tourism. I think if you give that assurance, the acceptance level will be higher. The Penang government has earlier said it will continue to collect a 3 ringgit hotel levy per room per night and the money will be used exclusively to promote tourism products in the state. Projects implemented from the money were agreed upon by a council comprising representatives from the hotel and tourism industry. Lim held a press conference on Wednesday at the Wan Utama Shopping Centre in Selangor to announce details of the I Love Penang Carnival and fun run to be held on July 2nd in Selangor.